Welcome to another episode of Kincaid Creations. I'm your host, Spencer. Good to be here, good to see you, and super excited to show you all what I've been working on today. Um, Spider-Man No Way Home finally dropped. We all know we've all been looking forward to that for months. Uh, I'm going to give you guys the classic two-minute warning on uh, spoilers. So when we get to the two-minute mark, I'll talk about the movie, some of the spoiler stuff, but you have before then to watch my showcase and see what I have made. Um, anyways, today I am showing off the Green Goblin, played by Willem Dafoe, who turned out so, so incredible. Um, I am super, super proud of how this whole figure turned out, because it's really actually simple, at least to me, um, even though it's complex. <laughs> um, I just, I like how well it turned out, despite the simplicity of the details I added. It looks, it looks so good. So, for function out, the glider obviously has parts to attach to studs. Uh, there's quite a bit that I made sure it can do. This stud right here is made so that you can attach this and have the same blades that killed Norman Osborn originally. Um, he has two studs here so that you can attach the pumpkin bomb and the razor bat. Um, unfortunately, my glue oversealed on this side, so it's kind of loose. But um, it still still works, relatively speaking, well. Um, so, turned out so, 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 so great, so wonderful. Oh, and, uh, these little two slots are lightsaber hilts that, uh, I cut apart and, uh, glued onto the glider so that you could put little orange pieces in them and make it look like he's shooting the machine guns that, uh, the glider has in the very first movie. I know there's three barrels, and I know people are gonna call me out on that because they're right, but size-wise, to make it work, I could only get one on each side, so function over uh, exact nature, we'll say. Now that we have passed the two-minute mark, uh, I can talk about spoilers, and man, Willem Dafoe playing Green Goblin in this movie was great, was great. I want there to be so much more of that, because he did so, 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 so well. And he complimented um, Tom Holland as Peter Parker so incredibly just as well. It was, I was impressed. I was very, very impressed. I liked it quite a bit. Um, <laughs> and, uh, I did try to get the head on this as close to Willem Dafoe as I possibly could, just because I knew he was gonna play it well. Um, I got as many details as I could. It's a Riddler head, believe it or not. I just shaved away his cheeseball domino mask and painted the eyes on. Anyways, everyone, I think that's going to do it for us for this one. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. Remember to like and subscribe, leave a comment, I read them all, and I will see you all in the next video.